Welcome to Cast and Cajun. I'm your host, Tony Fontenot. It's a cold, windy morning, but the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. Front came through last night, and the wind's been blowing about 25 miles an hour. So it's got the water really messed up. Looks like chocolate milk. We're going to take a ride and see if we can find some fish. So don't go away. You may have an exciting half hour with Cast and Cajun. I saw just about every charter fisherman I know yesterday, and they all told me the same thing. You go fishing tomorrow, you're wasting your time. That the winds are going to be blowing 25 miles an hour all night. Water's going to be messed up. Winds are going to be blowing 25 miles an hour tomorrow. But my niece has twin boys, 10 years old, been dying to go fishing with me. I promised them we'd go. I asked them if they wanted to reschedule. They said, no way, we want to go. So we came out, took a ride. Muddy water everywhere, wind blowing like crazy. Everything was telling me, go home. But I couldn't give up. Had to at least try. So we came back to Jug's Landing, anchored right across from the landing. So let's see what happens. Get him, Greg. One more. Take your time, take your time. <laughs> You're not too tired, huh? Yeah. Woo! I saw the big squirrel. This is good. Might be the biggest one you ever caught, huh? Yeah. Oh, Ooh, yeah, look at that big drum. Take your time. Don't break your line. <laughs> Yeah. Ah. Oh, yeah. Nice. Ah. Oh, yes, oh. indeed. Hey, picture from Facebook there. Yeah. yeah. If he can hold it up. No, oh, he can. Well, Jamie can hold it up for him. Yeah. Give me some dad, boy. Boom. You get on the truck, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nice, nice. Come over here with you. Get on this side of here with you. Come over here, sir. Seven. You got it? Yeah. All right, turn him side. <laughs> there you go. That's good. <laughs> We didn't have to do all that ride now, so I'll get him with this. Oh, you can net him. Go ahead, net him, brother. Uh, oh, he's heavy. Look out. Nothing like fishing with a kid. Hello? You can hear you. Hello? 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 H
<laughs> so I have. You got it. Take your time, man. Take your time. Let, him, let him fight. Let him fight. <laughs> got a big one now. Just reel when you can and then pull up. Reel down. Reel down. There you go. This is a blast. I love seeing kids have fun catching fish. Yes, indeed. Went right all over looking for good water. Come back by the home. It looked like chocolate milk, 25 mile an hour wind. Come back right across from the landing. The gold room. We could have just launched the boat and dropped that. That's it. Time, buddy. Wear him out. Just take your time. He'll get tired before you do. But you're an athlete. Starting to warm up a little bit now. We left the landing. Went through Grand Pass. Got out in the Sister Lake. Water looked like chocolate milk everywhere we went. Waves, foot and a half, two foot waves, 25 mile an hour winds blowing, splashing us. Couldn't find any good water. So we come back to last chance. Right across the street from Jug Seafood. Could have just launched the boat, put the troll motor down and dropped the anchor right here. As you can see, non-stop action. Bull drum. If we luck out, we might catch a couple bull reds too. Maybe even a couple of eaters. Come to Papa. I'll come to Uncle Tony. I'll bring Uncle Tony. Here, Uncle Tony. Here. Right, Whoa. Right, Just for months. Got him. Woo! Good eyes now. Oh, yeah. Let's name him David Hutchins. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, we just gonna have to cut the line on this one. He this David R.T. Yeah, son. he swallowed it. When you got a fish that swallows a hook like this, instead of jerking it out with pliers and possibly killing the fish, we just cut the line. And in the salt water, it'll usually disintegrate, and then the fish will be fine. Well, that was fun catching him, huh? Yeah. Number five. All right. Don't go away, we'll be right back with more casting cages. Welcome back, you're watching Casting Cajun. Yeah, baby. Small or big one? Oh, medium, I think. Not too small. But I don't think he's as big as the one you and Drake caught. I think I caught the biggest one. Yeah, you caught the biggest one, Luke. Saved about 30, 40 minutes. Not riding around. Mama. Oh, Woo. give me that yellow grab, that yellow up. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like a grabber? Uh, jerk. Uh -huh. Jerk. Can you put him in? Can you put him in? Woo. I guess you can. Ooh, he's a short fat one. Oh, you can play drums on him. You can play drums on him. And he's a drum. Playing drums on the drum. Turn. Get this way a little bit so you can see. Oh, I broke the hook. Uh, I'm gonna let him go easy like this. Okay, buddy. Go on. Oh, I don't have a hook though. You want to save him one hook? Yeah, I'll do it. Give me a shrimp off crab. Oh, uh, that's a good crap. You got the little hand gap up there? Yeah, I got the other one. Pull it, pull it straight up, Luke. There you go. The only bad thing about fishing right across from the landing, the last fish that Luke cooked, the boat passed and caught his fish and his line and broke it off.
Okay, you wear them out. That's the secret to fighting a big fish. If you try to go too fast, you get worn out. If you take your time and let the fish fight against themselves, against the rod, you get tired. You get tired, yes indeed. <laughs> Oh, he's not giving up. He's not, not yet, he will, I promise. Oh yeah, Woo! Oh, not a big one. They keep getting bigger and bigger. Trump! And uglier and uglier. This is my master Trump. Oh, real, 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 real. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Golly. Let me take a picture, Mr. Daniels. The biggest one so far, Ben. Yeah, it is. Biggest one so far. He got a big eyeball. <laughs> this one's almost as long as you. Oh, yeah. Wow. Got it. Good job, boy! Yeah. I set up on that one. I just saw my line swimming towards the boat. I said, what's my line doing next to the boat? Set the hook, and lo and behold, there it is. Okay, Drake, you gonna grab him in the lips for me with that, huh? Yeah, let him wear out a little bit. Oh, he's still... Take your time. Put it in his mouth. Whoa, whoa, let him, let him, let him relax. <laughs> He's not ready yet. Uh-huh. Yeah, he might have twisted your arm off if you put him that press. You ready? Okay, try to put it in his mouth. Jerk it hard, jerk it hard. All right, you got him. Can you put him in the boat? Can you put him in the boat? I guess you can. It's an old fish, so we want to be gentle with him. You gonna put him back in the water? All right, here we go. Just slide him over the side. He's still plenty lively. And there he goes. Here we are back at Jug's Landing. As you can see, it's pretty windy, but I think we all had a pretty good time, huh, fellas? Yeah. Yeah, yep, there you have it. As always, I want to give a special thanks to our military, active troops, and our veterans. So until next time, keep, keep on, on casting. casting.